We are in Windows 8 and Windows Server 8 and we're going to show you how to make changes to the keyboard settings. Get to Control Panel and from this icon right here and then we'll go to Keyboard. And from Keyboard we have several different options. The first one is the Repeat Delay and that's the delay before a key is starting to repeat if you hold down on it. So we'll go ahead and click Apply, and we'll open up Notepad to show you how long it is. So you can see it takes a while after I click before it starts to repeat. If we change that to a short delay, then the repeat should happen shortly after I hold the key down. Now the repeat rate is a little different, so if we choose the repeat rate to very fast, it'll just throw those keys up that we put in here in big chunks all at once. So there's a slight difference between the two but it's very important so if you have a hard time moving your fingers around the keys from one to the other then the repeat delay could make a big difference so you don't see duplicate keys. On the other hand if you want the repeat rate over here to go quickly it's because you want that to see the same letters and numbers over and over and over as fast as possible. The cursor blink rate is a little different. It doesn't really do a lot, but as you can see here, this is the rate that the cursor is currently blinking. If we change that to a much faster speed and click Apply, we'll see that it blinks faster. That's pretty much all it does. So there's some of the different options you can get with the keyboard. Click on Hardware and it shows you the type of keyboard that's installed.